Uh, my name is Will Wilson, and I am the Vision Project Manager for the Museum of Contemporary Native Art. And so what project were you just showing me? On the I was showing you this, which is called Manifestations, New Native Art Criticism. And it's a project that we've been doing for the last oh, three years here at the museum. And it focuses on the work of 60 um, living contemporary Native American artists who are U.S. based. Um, and there are 21 scholars that we've engaged, um, all who are also indigenous um, from the U.S. and Canada, um, who read about this. So it's also about the promotion of scholarship from kind of an indigenous perspective or point of view. Um, the book is hopefully going to um, be presented or launched during um, the Indian market here in Santa Fe um, this year, August uh, 2011. And um, this is the perspective cover for the book. And this is actually a dummy book. But, um, oh, how, how neat. <laughs> I, it was, I was like, what? <laughs> I know. <laughs> This is a comment on our culture. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> is, oh no. <laughs> no it's, um, white pages in a white culture. <laughs> Whoops, no, sorry. It's indecipherable. Um, no, this is this is a, the actual quality of the paper that's going to be used. The first, uh, I guess, first section with the four large contextual essays that kind of frame the field are going to be in black and white. Oh, I'm sorry. You're here. This is the director of the Museum of Contemporary Native Art. I'm sorry to know you're interviewing. Go ahead. So this is the, you know, this it, this is what the object will look like. Wonderful. Um, right now we're reviewing all of the image and text information, and hopefully on Monday it'll all get sent to the printer in China. So if someone wants to find out more information about this project, is, is there any place online where they can go? Yes. If you go, let's see, the best way to get to it would be to Google IAIA, the Institute of American Indian Arts Vision Project. Um, and the other part of this project um, is that there um, is a website with all of the essays that profile the 60 artists as well. So on the Vision Project website, you can go and you can learn about the work of Marcus Ammerman, um, all the way to, to my own work, uh, Will Wilson. Oh, I guess Stephen Yazzie is the, is the, is the why. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, he's the last one. So, But there are 60 profiles up, and it, the, the website's live right now, so awesome, awesome. we're hoping it'll be a... And what kind of work do you do? What, what Besides this project, what are you um, focusing on? I kind of do photo-based installation. Um, and there's a piece of mine right over there. Um, that Hogan that's sitting in the courtyard uh, that Hayes is standing in front of. Um, it's not fully installed yet. It's going to be a Hogan greenhouse. Um, and I'm cultivating indigenous food species um, inside that greenhouse. Indigenous food species in that greenhouse. Awesome. In that greenhouse. And, you know, it's kind of a site specific piece, so every different place it goes, it, you know, I look at regional indigenous food species. So there's actually another one of these that's going to go up to the Denver Botanical Garden in oh, uh, the next couple of weeks. Um, they're propagating my, my, my seed right now, and then it'll get transplanted into the other Hogan greenhouse. Um, it's part of a broader project called the Autoimmune Response Project. Oh, nice, nice. Um, did you go to school here? I did well. I went to school in Albuquerque. Yes. I got my MFA in photography uh, from UNM. And, uh, and your, I'm sorry. Oh no. <laughs> and your website. My website. I don't really or, have a dedicated website. I mean, if you Google Will Wilson, okay, artist or photographer or autoimmune response, you'll find a lot of web presences, I guess. Well, thank you very much. Sure, thank, thank you. Thank you for your work.